Hi everyone, I'm back and I'm going to read you today a couple of poems from Women Poets. It's a book that I've had for a while. It's called The Penguin Book of Women Poets and I have been saving some of these poems um, for some occasion and I think here is the occasion. So, thank you for tuning in. Oh, before I forget, please subscribe. I've been watching a lot of these uh, YouTube videos recently and I see that everyone just keeps reminding, subscribe, subscribe. I guess I have to do the same thing. So please subscribe because that means that more people are watching. That means it encourages me to make more of these videos. Okay, so here's a poem by Emily Dickinson and it's called Wild Nights. I don't think it has a title, but it starts with Wild Nights, so I'm calling it Wild Nights. Wild Nights, wild nights, were I with thee, wild nights should be our luxury. Futile the winds to a heart in port, done with the compass, done with the chart, rowing in Eden, Ah, the sea might I but more tonight in thee. All right, let's see what else I had marked. Ah, here is one. Tuck, 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 tuck. Just passed it. Okay. This is a Roman poetess, Sulpicia, Sulpicia probably, if you pronounce it in Italian. And, um, but in Latin, I think it would be Sulpicia. She is only known Latin poet. So here it is. It's 20 BC, quite a while. Draft my hateful birthday to be spent in the boring old country. It's going to be a day of mourning without Cerinthus to hug. Oh, the joy of city life is a musty old country house, any fit place for a girl, and that freezing river at Arezzo. Please, sweet Messala, relax, too anxious as ever for my comfort. Banish the grim expedition totally out of your mind. If I'm to be snatched away, I leave heart and soul behind here, since I'm not to be granted license to run my life. I'm grateful, really grateful for the favor you've just done me. You've saved me from being a fool and rushing into your arms. Go chasing whores as you will, seducing maids from their sewing. So much better prospects, I'm sure, than the daughter of Servius Sulpicius. The main thing, prompting the kind friend who told on you was the pain of seeing me lose out to a love couch of no standing. Let your longing for me, my love, lose the heart of a few days ago. If I have ever before committed in the whole world of my youthful life as stupid a mistake as this or one I've regretted more. I left you yesterday night, ran off and left you alone. Honestly, love, it was only that I didn't dare show my passion. Okay, I hope you enjoyed them. It was a bit of an impromptu situation, but I just didn't want to keep missing or skipping days. So here I am with an impromptu couple of poems from women poets from the Penguin Book of Women Poets. Thank you very much. Bye.